The Griffon is a new French armored troop carrier with 6x6 configuration. It was developed to meet requirement of the French Vehicule Blind Multiroles VBMR, program, which called for a new multi-purpose armored vehicle to replace an aging VAB armored personnel carrier, which is used by the French Army in large numbers. Since the early 2000s French Army was looking for a VAB replacement. This old armored personnel carrier has 4x4 configuration and is operational since 1976. The new armored vehicle was developed by a temporary consortium of French companies, comprising Nexta Systems, Renault Trucks Defense and Thales. Development commenced in 2011. A BMX-01 demonstrator was a forerunner of the Griffon. It was first publicly revealed in 2014. This vehicle was developed by Renault Trucks Defense and had 80% similarity with the current Griffon. Prototype of the Griffon was first publicly revealed in 2016. In 2017 French Army ordered a first batch of 319 Griffons. Deliveries began in 2019. In 2020 another 271 units were ordered for delivery in 2022 to 2023. Until 2025 the French Army planned to acquire a total of 1,722 Griffon armored vehicles in several different variants. In 2017 Belgium ordered a total of 417 Griffons for delivery in 2025. The Griffon has conventional layout with engine compartment at the front, crew cabin in the middle and troop compartment at the rear. However, this armored vehicle has a different design than the VAB and is significantly heavier. The Griffon is much higher than the VAB due to its V-shaped hull, which provides protection against landmines and improvised explosive devices. Mine protection of this vehicle is similar to that of dedicated mine-resistant ambush-protected vehicles. Essentially, the Griffon fills the gap between armored personnel carriers and mine-resistant ambush-protected vehicles. It is better suited for unconventional warfare and low-intensity military conflicts. The Griffon offers better protection for its crew and occupants than the VAB. Its steel armor hull provides protection against small arms fire, artillery shell splinters. The baseline steel armor can be fitted with add-on armor kit for a higher level of protection. So protection level can be tailored depending on mission requirements. Maximum level of ballistic protection is against 14.5mm armor-piercing rounds. The Griffon also offers significantly higher level of protection than the VAB against landmines and improvised explosive devices. It withstands blasts equivalent to 10kg of TNT anywhere under the hull. This armored vehicle is also fitted with an NBC protection system. The Griffon is operated by a crew of two, and can carry eight dismounts. The main role of this vehicle is to deliver troops to the battlefield under armor protection. For entry and exit crew members use side doors, while the infantrymen dismount via rear power operated ramp with integral doors. Also there are roof hatches for emergency exit. Some vision blocks are provided for the dismounts. Though there are no firing ports in order not to compromise the armor protection. This armored vehicle is fitted with remotely controlled weapon station. Armed with 12.7mm or 7.62mm machine gun, or alternatively a 40mm automatic grenade launcher. It can be also fitted with 81mm mortar or two French MMP anti-tank guided missiles. These are fire and forget type missiles with a maximum range of 4000m. The remotely controlled weapon station is coupled with an acoustic sniper location system. This armored vehicle is also fitted with other defensive systems, such as laser warning system and missile detection system. The Griffon is fitted with a battlefield management system, which allows the troops and combat vehicles to share information on the battlefield. The Griffon uses automotive components of commercial 6x6 off-road truck. It was designed for simple maintenance and servicing. This armored vehicle is powered by a Renault D117 turbocharged diesel engine, developing 400 horsepower. It is a standard commercial truck engine, however it has been adapted to use a wider range of fuel. The engine is mated to an automatic transmission. Vehicle has 6x6 configuration with full-time all-wheel drive. It is fitted with a central tire inflation system. Unlike the VAB, the Griffon lacks amphibious capability. The Griffon can be configured to suit many roles. The baseline troop transport vehicle will be the most numerous. Though a number of other Griffon versions are planned to fulfill specialized roles. Variants 
Griffin ATV is a baseline troop transport vehicle. This version was ordered by the French Army. Griffin EPC Command Post Vehicle. This version was ordered by the French Army. Griffin Sanitary Armored Ambulance. This version was ordered by the French Army in 2020. Deliveries are planned to begin in 2022 to 2023. Griffin Voa Artillery Observation Post Vehicle. It carries sensors for surveillance and artillery observation and fire control. This version was ordered by the French Army. This version was ordered by the French Army in 2020. Deliveries are planned to begin in 2022 to 2023. Recovery Vehicle. Refueling Vehicle. Armored Engineer Vehicle. Jaguar Armored Reconnaissance Vehicle, operated by a crew of three and armed with a 40mm cannon. It was developed alongside the Griffin. Both of these armored vehicles share 70% of their components. The Jaguar is capable of reconnaissance, fire support and rapid intervention. This reconnaissance vehicle was ordered by the French Army and will be fielded alongside the Griffin. Deliveries are planned to begin in 2022.